Must be in grind mode. <laughs> Hello there, Bell Welding, Bear? Bear Welding. This is Caden with Bear Welding. So our captain over here sent us some products to try. So we got the helmet and the TIG 205 Pro and we're gonna unbox them and kind of see how they go today. All right, we're gonna pull this out, see what's inside. You know, I've been thinking about buying myself a TIG torch. This one is a good price, so you might have another customer. So right here, we've got our TIG torch right here. You know, got the consumables, that's nice that they actually give you some cups and collets and things. We have our stick lead, you know, ground. You always need a ground to weld, just so you know. Gas line, you know, any type you're doing TIG, you'll always need that gas line. And then we have the welder, good packaging, you know. You know you won't get a, a broken machine. Holy! Well, it's actually pretty small. That's nice. Got the small machine right here on your standard hookup. Looks like they have a nice LED screen. Good size. Probably gives you all that information and we'll look at that more when we turn it on. Huh. You have a nice little case for it. All right, this is one of the cool things about this is that it comes with an app that you can change a lot of everything a lot of the settings on it, you know, like anything these days. You know, I can see like, there's been a few times I've been up on a ladder welding like a rail out and I kind of wish it was a little hotter or colder or whatnot. And this can fix that. The other nice thing is, is, you know, you have a pretty good size screen, but your buttons are pretty limited. So I can go in here, you know, I can change quite a bit, you know, change it from 4T to 2T. For those that are confused about this, 4T is you press the button to start a weld and you can release and it'll just keep going. The arc keeps going and then you press it to stop. 2T is you the arc will only work while you're holding that button down. So you can kind of go for whatever your preference is. But a nice thing is I can go into the TIG torch, change how much the flow is. You know, we're just gonna be messing around on carbon steel so post flow is not a huge thing. They were nice enough also to send us a hood. So I'll be trying that out today. All right, as I'm getting set up here, you know, looked at the hood, looks pretty nice. You know, it has like the grind shades all on the outside, which is kind of nice so you can change it. There's been a few times where I've accidentally gave myself flash burn because I didn't realize mine was in, you know, the button gets pressed on the side, throws it into grind mode. Oh, must be in grind mode. <laughs> Try the first weld with the TIG 205 Pro. I have it in 2T mode because that's what I'm used to. So, I'll try it out. All right, that's pretty cool. Just stay stable. Don't have to hold the button. Flex the hand. Oh, that's pretty cool. I like that. All right, so I just did a little unboxing, little demos. So next we're gonna have Tigmaster Jake run it through its paces, break it in, find out what this little machine can really do. 